Hi guys, hi, welcome back to the channel. I thought I'd do something new for you guys. Today is Wednesday, uh, July the 29th, guys. We're about to hit August. But I just wanted to bring you back here on my deck and just bring you guys along and welcome you guys to the channel, to the Simply Natural Black Life channel, where we do all things simple. Um, today's video you're gonna see is gonna be the actual office tour that you've been waiting on. So guys, I'm just doing room by room. So actually after the office tour, we have the bonus room, the bedroom, living room, dining room, and then I'll do a whole house tour. So guys, with that being said, um, let me know what you think. Leave me down some, um, leave me some, um, skirt. sorry y'all, I'm looking for my, for my thing for the, um, to cut this off. So let me know in the comments what you guys think, and thank you so much for all your lovely comments and everything, and um, yeah, what a wonderful day to bring you guys outside with me. The wind is blowing, it's around 90 degrees here and it's just a beautiful beautiful day so guys i'll see you in the house all right let's go ahead and get into the video here we are walking down the hallway just like we had to do for the bathroom so this is the hallway this door here is the office so let's get ready to enter into the office the door has been painted a bright beautiful white and like i told you guys the little post here i absolutely love those and I love the old-fashioned handles. So let's go into the room, y'all. Are y'all ready? Are y'all ready? Yes. Welcome to my office, guys. Welcome to Sonia's office. Thanks for coming in. And how may I help you? <laughs> okay, guys. Here we have... Guys, you should remember this shelving unit that Mark and I uh, made uh, for the previous home. We actually found a uh, board to a bed frame and we picked it up and bought it home and we did a project on it. And this is how it turned out. And as you remember, we painted it a weathered gray. We have added these and this was in the dining room area of the other house. So I decided to put it in this office because I just thought it would look better and I really think it does. So um, let me know what you think. So what I did was I kept all the plants, all the plants on the shelf except for the middle one because I wanted to incorporate blue and you guys will see why I wanted to incorporate that beautiful blue with that wood base. You guys know I love, 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 love wood. So that is the wood at the base and this is, you know, that's wood itself. So yeah, so um, this is what I decided to do. And down here, guys, remember this was in my um, in my bedroom up in the closet area. And it's just housed like important papers and stuff. Not nobody can like really steal or anything because things have been Xerox and copied, put somewhere else. But that's where I put that. So guys, I think this looks very, 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 very nice. This room is very relaxing. I love coming in here. So behind the door, I have my uh, ring light, which I don't really never use at all, but I decided to put it there because the closet in the inside has to be painted in here. So yeah, so guys, um, here is the back of the door. Like I said, it has these little um, square cutouts here. Well, not cutouts, but uh, pieces of design. So guys, if you are wondering, I'm gonna tell you that this wall here, this wall all the way over here to this side, is repost gray repost gray y'all so this color here is repost gray the other color is mindful gray i don't know if you guys can tell the difference but i'm gonna try to pull up on it and so you can see so repost gray mindful gray are the colors of this office okay and that's basically the color um in another room i have to share that with you later so over here guys remember i told you i was going to get rid of those two uh pictures that i had in that um in that um, storage storage room guys I decided to put this large picture in here to make it the focal point from the hallway that you could see it is very very pretty and you guys know this is a nice large piece and you should always decorate your walls with larger pieces than you would smaller pieces because it just give it a better illusion to the eye and it gives it's a better concept for the room as well so up here guys I hung this beautiful um, um, I forgot what they call this Greek 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 mirror and I don't know if I want to bring it down just a tad I think I might bring it down just a little bit 
because I was deciding not to keep it or not and just have this wall to be blank or find me a really like real thin light gold frame mirror, but it'd be circle, but it'd be a large one. So I'm not sure. So I might bring it down because it's very unique piece. Um, let me bring you guys down for the uh, contrast so you can actually see what I'm saying. So guys, yes, that's how that looks. Now you can see the different colors of the, this is mindful gray. This is repost gray. I think I'm saying it right, y'all. This is, this is, no. Yeah, this is my, this is repost gray. This is mindful gray. So guys, we have a beautiful window here. Beautiful big window. Um, I love the fact that a whole lot of air blows through here on my beautiful plant. And um, have so much space, guys, to just go and move around. I can just get through my desk. I could just get, this room is really big. This is actually a bedroom that I just turned into an office. So, guys, here I have my um, my beautiful chair. I did not get rid of my chair. Y'all remember, I found this chair for $5, and I did all of this all myself. I painted it, fabric painted it, put my nail head trim on it, and um, worked on the bottom of it because it was falling. Still needs a little tw uh, tweaking, but all in all, it's really doing a great job. I've been able to sit in it maybe because I'm not that heavy that it won't fall down, but I don't know about anybody else, but for me, it's working. So guys, I added, I got rid of the big gold large pillow that had those stripes that matched that rug. I um, incorporated this one only and I bought this pretty blue. Guys, this blue is so pretty. So now you understand. I had this blue with the blue in the um, canvas that I DIY'd, y'all, and the blue on the shelf. And then the gold just actually uh, incorporates it, like the gold on the legs of the desk. Y'all remember this desk was... Uh, uh, bought from Goodwill for I think ten dollars. Yeah, ten dollars. So what I did was I took the plant that was on The shelf right here. I just took it and bought it over here I think it looks better it has the gold legs It's black and it just goes with the theme of the room and um, Here I have a mercury glass uh, Threshold candle holder. I think it was supposed to be threshold. I probably took the top guys I just I love the way that looks it's all wood at the bottom and you see how it has like these imprints of the wood. Look at that textures, textures of the wood. Um, it just brings everything out. I just like how I did that. Everything is light, airy, and simple. On this wall here, I just kept my, um, I don't know if you guys can, well, let me bring it down. I just kept my calendar here. So yeah, that's um, all I did here in this office. And guys, remember, this is the closet. And let me bring you guys back up. This is the closet. And there's really not uh, too much in here. I have to paint in here. So we just have my um, box back there for the printer. And there's a box here for um, some of my products and my, my product sign. So yeah, this closet goes all the way back, guys. And it does have to be finished painted um, all white. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this tour. And like I said, the colors on the wall are Mindful Gray and Repose Gray. I just wanted an accent. So this here is the accent wall. The wall here is the is the mindful gray. The wall here is the mindful gray. Mindful gray. And behind here is the mindful gray. So yes, guys, that is the office tour. And I have like a little book here. Uh, one of my clients uh, suggested that I... Uh, Google this and find, it's called Passing On, and it just gives you resources to where to um, donate things. If you have things at home that you're trying to get rid of, you can find ways to donate it, like reading glasses, cell phones, anything like that. That's what you would do. So that's what that, that's why that book is there, and I just took it out of my desk. Oh, I forgot to show you guys. This is, I can't show you too much because I got that door open, but this is my desk for all of you who are new here. So I'm just going to show you a pan around how that looks, y'all. Here is the canvas. Here. Closet. Beautiful color wall. And you see the different colors, y'all? Repulse. Mindful gray. All the way around. Okay? All the way around. With beautiful curtains. I love these curtains. That's why I didn't want to get rid of this um, Greek key um, uh, mirror because I think it goes with the curtains as well. And there is my beautiful stand. You guys remember... I painted her and she is housing my beautiful, um, uh, not San Severa, well, in the San Severa uh, family. So that's um, how that looks. 
I'm debating if I want to spray paint this instead of silver or gold. So you guys let me know in the comments below. So that's how it looks, guys. From This is the hallway. As you go out, that's the living room and stuff. And this way is the bathroom. And then here is my mirror again. And yeah, I'm just trying to show you guys everything before I end this video. So guys, that's how the office, that is the office. Yeah, my computer's in there, if you're wondering. So I don't leave it out all the time, only when I'm working. So guys, let me know in the comments, what do you think? Uh oh, almost gave y'all a glance of that. <laughs> what do you think about the office? Let me know. I know you guys will let me know in the comments below. I think I did a very good job. And I just recently felt that I needed to put this in here a couple days ago because you guys are going to see when you see the living room, dining room, you're going to understand. I just felt as though this blue wasn't doing the trick in the living room area. It was working a little bit in the dining room, but you guys, you'll see how I did that, how I pulled that off because I'm just working with space and I'm working with, I just want an airy, spacious home where it's not doing too much. So guys, with that being said, I'm going to let you guys go. But like I said, mindful gray on this wall repost gray on this wall and as you can see now you can see the difference from me standing here so i'm going to go back out of the office we're going to turn. oh here's the beautiful light y'all let me turn it off so you guys can see but here's the light switch here so this is how even with the light off the light the light in here is very very um very bright for my plants and that i love so this is what you see when you come in or you stand by the um, the hallway. So let me know in the comments what you think. I'm glad you guys tuned in today to see this video. And go back. I'm going to insert a card of this room, the color it was of the wall, the ugly fan that was in here. And uh, yeah, it looks totally, totally different, guys. Paint and doing your own DIYs can transform a room um, at any given time. So guys, be blessed and always remember... Love yourself so that you will love others and this world will be a much better place. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And always remember too, who, even if you don't like it, I love it and that's all that matters to me. Okay? Bye y'all.